Bob, you see, you see my brother Mike? He's in the back. So what's the story? Where'd you come from? How is he? George, where'd you sleep? Michael, how is he? How's Dad? He's dead. No. Yeah, he died a couple minutes after you left last night. This is bad. This is very bad. Yeah. It, you know, it was strange. Near the end, he seemed almost... Did he wake up or anything? For about a minute. Did he say anything? Well, what did he say, Michael? He said he was sorry. Sorry? Yeah. You know, I guess for not being much of a father to us or something. Sorry. Oh, that's good. That's, that's rich. Sorry. Sorry. Well, did he say anything else? No, he didn't. Why do you keep asking me that? Asking you what? If he said anything. You keep asking me, did he say anything? Do I, really? Yeah, continuously, since last night. Huh. huh. I didn't notice. Strange. Yeah, it would be strange, George, if it was someone other than you. What are you up to? Nothing. You think he told me, don't you? Told you what? Where it's hidden. Where what is hidden? The money. Did he? No. What I want to know is what he told you. And last night, I was on the phone. He was talking to you about something. What was it? He told you, didn't he? Yeah, he told you. But he didn't tell you everything, because otherwise you wouldn't be here trying to figure out what I know. George, the money. George, get your, money. Get, your head, get, your head, get your hands off me, George. Let go of me. Okay, all right, I'm sorry. Okay? I'm sorry, all right? All right. I'm a, I'm, I'm a little tense. I haven't eaten, all right? Okay. Okay. So, all right, I'm sorry. All right. Now, obviously, we both know something here. Okay, now, the only way we're gonna make this work is if we cut some kind of deal, right? I, I, I don't like deals. I don't know from deals. I don't know. All right, what do you got in mind? A partnership. We split the money 50-50. I tell you what I know, you tell me what you know. 50-50? Right. I tell you what I know, and, and you tell me what you know. Exactly. So? What did he tell you? Well, wait a minute, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. How come I have to go first? Someone's got to go first, George. Yeah, but how come it's got to be me? Because if you were me, would you trust you? No, I guess not, no. Okay, all right, okay. He... he told me where it is. Where? Where, where? where is it? Wait a minute, wait a minute, hold on. How... What did he tell you? He, he gave me a number. He gave you a number? What number? A, a locker number. A locker number? What's, what's the number? What am I, an idiot? I'm not going to tell you the number. You didn't tell me where it is. Michael, tell me the number. Why should I? Because I'm your big brother. I need the money. What? And, and I don't? George, don't touch me. I told you what I Keep do. Keep your hands to yourself. Remember what happened? You're not going to find out anything this way. Take it out of the I'm going to do it to you again. George, I'm going to do it. Give me the number. Give me the number. All I want is the number, Michael. Just don't give me the number. Don't even think. Don't even try that. I don't think I'll defend myself. I'll reach one of you. Sonny Charlie, I'll give you this thing. Oh, oh. What the fuck are you two idiots doing? Back it up. All right. He started. I don't give a fuck who started it. Michael, did I tell you to call me? Yeah, you did. My phone didn't ring. That's because I didn't get a chance to call you. Maybe you're a little too busy, huh? No. no I'm not saying I was too busy. Well, I told you to call me. No, you, you said to call you if I talked to my father. Now, I didn't talk to him. Hey, 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 what, what, what's going on here, Michael? Who the fuck are these guys, huh? He says he's a friend of Dad's. You a friend of my old man's? My old man didn't have no friends. Who the fuck are you? You must be George. I know who I am. I asked you, who the fuck are you? I'm Earl. Earl? Right, what the hell is that all about? Nice to meet you, Earl. How do you do? I don't know. 
You think maybe the three of us could go somewhere and have a little chat? It won't take too long. Well, you know, that's a very nice suggestion, Earl, but my brother and I, we are in the middle of a little bit of a family discussion here, and we have to complete it, so at this time, we cannot come with you. Um, I really think that you should come with me. <laughs> I don't think you understand me, Earl. I'm telling you that we cannot come with you at this time. Not, not now. Maybe you don't understand. Let me convince you. Like I said, Earl, we are not coming with you. No fucking way. I got a bad feeling about this, man. I mean, we're in a fucking warehouse here. We're, we're locked in a warehouse. Just relax, will you, Michael? Relax, relax. That's easy for you to say, George. You're a hardened criminal, OK? You're used to being locked in small places. Michael, will you do me a favor? Just get a hold of yourself. Get a hold of myself? Get a hold of myself? Excuse me, I I'm scared shitless, all right? I I've got an aversion to being kidnapped. Well, I guess it runs in the family. I don't like it either. You don't like it either? You know, it's all your fault. My fault? Why is it my fault? I it's always been your fault. Michael, if I remember correctly, it was me who took care of you and protected you when we were growing up. George, what are you talking about? Mom died, Dad went to jail, you took off. Yeah, but not right away. Yeah, but soon enough. It's always been the same thing. You, Dad, you, and your fucking guns. What are you talking about, me and my fucking guns? You and, and all the violence shit. That's why I'm here. I, I, I've spent one day with you, and, and look what happens to me. Hey, let me tell you something. I may pull the occasional stick up, all right? But what you do is genuinely disgusting. Ripping off old people, pretending you're their friend. I mean, how could you do shit like that? OK, I admit it. It's not the best line of work, but it pays the bills. And I don't shoot people. Hey, Michael, I don't shoot people either. If they're stupid enough to try something with a gun sticking in their face, then hey, that's not my fault. That's their fault. That, that is the most ridiculous thing I ever heard. That, that's unbelievable. Michael, what are, we, what are we arguing for? There's $500,000 out there with our name on it. It belongs to us. We should be thinking in terms of escape, all right? And yeah. we should be working together on this thing. That's right. OK? OK. Because I'm telling you, these are some, some very bad people out there. Yeah. And they'll do some very bad things to us. All right, George. So we're going to work together, right? Yeah, whatever it takes. Because I know it's what Dad would have wanted. That's right. All right. Okay. Michael. Michael. Oh. If you had done what I told you, you wouldn't be sitting there right now. I told you you were going to get in a lot of trouble, didn't I? Yes, yes, you did, Earl. You most certainly did. Well, I think we should cut all the bullshit, don't you? Absolutely. I couldn't agree with you more. Uh, well, I mean, you're going to tell us anyhow. I was going to tell you. I I'm going to tell you anything you want to know, Earl. Good. That's good. I, I want to cooperate. You want to cooperate? That's great. Where's the money? W what money? What money? Michael, I know your father was at your house last night with a bullet in his belly. What did he tell you? Well, now, actually, Earl, I, I wasn't at home last night. George was. Thank you, Michael. George was. So what's the answer? The answer? Fuck you. Fuck you. <laughs> the answer is fuck you. That's <laughs> funny. You motherfucker. Where is it, George? 
Up your mother's ass. George, you're not being very nice. Fuck you. If you haven't figured it out, I'm not telling. Unzip his fly and cut his dick off. Coney Island, storage locker near Stillwell Avenue. See? That wasn't so difficult. Now you're being nice. What's the locker number? He didn't tell me. But he told Michael. Well, Michael, it's your turn again. Where is it? He's lying. I don't know where it is. Might as well tell him, Michael. I, I have no idea what my brother is talking about. Michael. Earl, I swear to God, I don't know nothing. And zip his fly. With pleasure. Uh, what? Uh, 692? What makes me think that you're not telling me the truth? Earl, I'm, I, I'm not the liar here, Earl. He is. Open his pants. Oh, holy shit! It's not worth it, Michael. You might as well just tell uh, him I the am, truth. I am, I am. It's uh, 532. Take his pants uh, down. Uh, 1131. 965. It's 965, fucking for crying out loud. Hold it right there. Don't fucking move. Who the fuck are you guys? The police! Drop your fucking gun! The cops? Oh, Jesus, thank God! These men, they're trying to kidnap us! You guys are cops? You ain't cops! The fuck do you think this is, asshole? Anybody can get one of those. You believe this guy? All right. Drop your fucking guns now! We ain't dropping our guns. I own this building, pal. It's private fucking property. And if you're cops, what do you want? Oh, Roy, they're not dropping their fucking guns. I can see that, you idiot! I said, what do you want? These two. They're under arrest. Under arrest? For what? what? What did we do? Yeah. Why are they under arrest? I don't have to answer to you. No? Well, I think you do! Not being shot at, right? That, that, that's, that's a plus. Joy! 
Dodge!